Good Friday morning, this March 25th, day number five for me. Um, I do not think I'm going to attempt granite wrap, or bleh, I do not think I'm going to attempt crystal rapids today. I think I'm going to head on over towards Agate Canyon. I'm not sure how far I'll go. I think Agate Canyon's about 4.6 miles. If I go further, I can go to Sapphire, and that is like six miles, one way. So, I don't know. I'll go for two hours or so. We'll see how I'm feeling. But anyway, I just figured I'd let you know what I'm up to this morning. That is my plan, and I will be heading up the trail this way. All right, just a short ways from camp in all reality maybe maybe three or maybe a third of a mile my brain is just going dead but anyway i think that's the finger formation i am not sure battery's going to go die on me but if you look down you can see um slate creek is flowing again down there and there's a nice big tree so it, it kind of goes above and below ground at times just you know seeps here and there where it wants to so anyway, that's looking back up to where my camp is out there. I just, just noticed the glistening when I stopped to take pictures. And that is some of the view. I'm trying to capture everything I can before this battery dies. And then um, I will change it out. But I don't know. I think that's a really cool formation there too. All right, pretty big cairn there and kind of a nice area to get a all around view. So I'm stopping and doing just that. Um, the Tonto here isn't too bad. Um, I guess the brutal part about this section is the lack of water and there is really no shade. I mean, even when you're tucked into the little drainages, there is not much shade. Even where my camp is at, it is minimal. So, you know, it's, it is a harsher area. Many of the other areas have, you have access to the water when you're on the Escalante and the Tonto there, there's some pretty perennial creeks or you're close enough to the river to get, to get yourself some water. But anyway, just thought you'd enjoy this. I'm going to go on. A little bit of a climb up here. I mean, nothing major, but I'm breathing heavy. So I figure I'd stop, take some pictures. And since it is kind of a higher point and the views are changing, it'd be a good time to take some video. That is one thing that just amazes me is... Um, you cross saddles or, you know, come out of certain drainages and you see stuff that you, you couldn't see before and details and, all right, I'm looking for it now. I saw it in my brain, just lost it. Okay, if you look down there, there's kind of a little tower rock. I'm thinking it's about centered in the video there, but I'll just continue around. But yeah, it is... No clouds. This has been, for the most part, a cloudless, cloudless trip. Clouds make for some awesome um, pictures and time lapse, but I guess this is what I have here. Pretty awesome view here, but as you can see, just going straight up ahead, that is the trail. Um, the trail is fairly faint at times, but anyway, since I stopped, I'm just going to do a little 
can here. Sorry, poles get stuck. I usually try to pick them up. But we caught the moon and okay, I don't know if the moon will show up there. I caught the moon in a few pictures. Anyway, this is where I'm at right now along the Tonto between Slate and Agate Canyon. I'm back up. But there's the trail. I mean, you can see it, but it is, it is faint. Anyway, later. All right, so I'm going to turn around here. Um, yeah, I've been going about hour, 40 minutes, maybe an hour and a half of actual hiking with picture taken and stuff like that. But I uh, figure I'll head back to camp now. I did not get a glimpse of the river, but um, I can head back to camp, uh, eat some lunch, and maybe head back up to that like, nice cool area for the afternoon up Slate Creek. But anyway, um, yeah, so I got a taste of further, further west down the Tonto. Um, not too bad, you know, when you get to these areas like this, it, it's kind of rocky and scrambly. There's a little, um, not that one, but there's one tucked right there. I'm going to probably, you know, take a quick break there. But anyway, I will probably see you back at camp unless something spectacular goes on. Not sure if you can see him, but there's this raven. He's been like flying around and making quite a bit of noise. He is uh, probably near centered in the screen right now, but we'll see if he flies again. He is, yeah, the largest critter I've seen here. Um, there he is. He just flew up that way. He's been like making noise at me. He's perched up there now. So I don't know if he'll show up, but anyway. It is Friday afternoon, um, 3.30 or so, and this sun is intense. I ended up just going to the pool where I've been getting my water from because I was hot, so I just like poured some water over me and got my shirt and stuff wet and found some shade by my camp. Um, there is some shade here. But, yeah, I just kind of have to move around. And it's just so crazy because once the sun drops, you know, below uh, the canyon walls, it gets cool quick. Although last night, it didn't really cool off. I did not need my, um, what is it? I don't even know. My, um as my daughter would say, my ninja style um, knit leggings and top, or as I call it, fancy long underwear. But um, yeah, I think I pulled the bottoms on about five o'clock in the morning. It finally, it finally cooled off. But anyway, this is like, I'm calling this like the little kitchen area. I sit down right there because the sun has dipped for dinner usually, so it's not blasting me. And then, um, my food is over here hanging in the tree and I've got my water and I can sit right there when I want to filter water. And then right now I've been hiding, been hiding over here. I can sit on that upper one, but it rocks a little bit. So I'm kind of move this one over here and it's a little bit more stable. But yeah, here's my camp from a different angle if you're interested in. It's just kind of, I don't know, I thought it was kind of fun three days. It's like, I have a spot to sleep, and then I have a spot where I can, you know, do other stuff. Right now I'm just sitting and reading. Um, yeah, 
But anyway, it is, it is pretty gorgeous. So again, no clouds. I mean, and that sun is, that sun is brutal. I'm going to be a crispy critter when I get done with this trip. Anyway, my raven seems to have gone, so I will be done for now. Later.